King Charles made his first public appearance on Sunday morning as he stepped out in Norfolk to attend a service St. Lawrence's Church in Castle Rising. The monarch, 74, delighted royal fans with outing and greeted their king with smiles all round as he headed over to meet them after the service. This is the first time Charles has been seen appearing publicly since Harry's tell-all book Spare was unanticipatedly published on Thursday morning. However, Charles was spotted on the day the book was published being driven out of Sandringham Estate. In Harry's memoir there are a number of bombshell claims about his father. In one section of the novel, he claimed that he along with his brother William and grandmother Queen Elizabeth II, didn't want Charles to marry Camilla. Harry said he and William specifically asked their father not to marry the now Queen consort, but he added that neither brother held it against their father when he did. The Duke spoke candidly about his relationship with his father throughout the book, even revealing that Charles had originally envisioned a different name for him. He claimed that due to the Queen's love of Queen Victoria, Charles had wanted to name Harry Albert, after her husband, but Princess Diana wasn't keen on the name, leading to the pair naming him Henry, which Harry is a nickname for. The King's original name choice was, however, chosen as one of Harry's middle names. Other major revelations in the book include what the then Duchess of Cambridge thought when he told her and Prince William that he was dating Meghan Markle. Harry's last conversation with the Queen before her death and how Harry believed Diana was in hiding for years, can be seen in our full roundup piece of the biggest stories to emerge from the publication.